Hi, welcome to Feel Korean TV Math Corner. Today, we will tackle changing improper fractions to mixed numbers and mixed numbers to improper fractions. Let's start the lesson by knowing the mixed number and improper fraction. When we say mixed number, it has a whole number and a proper fraction, like 10 and 2 thirds. 10 is a whole number and 2 thirds is a proper fraction, in which the numerator 2 is less than the denominator 3. Improper fraction has a numerator greater than or equal to the denominator. Examples, 5 fourths and 8 eighths. The numerator 5 is greater than the denominator 4. And the numerator 8 is equal to the denominator 8. Now, let's proceed in changing mixed number to improper fraction. Let's take this example, 9 and 3 fifths. To change mixed number to improper fraction, multiply the whole number and the denominator, then add the numerator to get the new numerator and copy the denominator. Okay, let's answer. 9 times 5 equals 45 plus 3 equals 48. Copy the denominator 5. The answer is 48 fifths or 48 over 5. Okay, let's have another example. 7 and 2 thirds. Let us answer. 7 times 3 equals 21 plus 2 equals 23. Then, copy the denominator 3. The answer is 23 over 3. This time, we will proceed in changing improper fractions to mixed number. Let's take this example, 18 fifths. To change improper fraction to mixed number, divide the numerator by the denominator. Express the answer in lowest term if necessary. Let's answer 18 divided by 5. 18 divided by 5 equals 3. 3 times 5 equals 15. Subtract 18 minus 15 equals 3. Let's write the answer. The quotient 3 is the whole number. And the remainder 3 is the numerator, then the denominator is still 5. The answer is 3 and 3 fifths. Let's try another one, 24 over 18. So let's divide 24 divided by 18. 24 divided by 18 equals 1. 1 times 18 equals 18. Subtract. 24 minus 18 equals 6. Now, let's write the answer. The quotient 1 is the whole number. The remainder 6 is the numerator and the denominator is still 18. The answer is 1 and 6 eighths. But the fraction 6 eighths can be reduced to lowest term because 6 and 18 have common factors. So, we need to divide them by their GCF. The GCF of 6 and 18 is 6. Now, let's answer. Write the whole number 1. Then divide 6 divided by 6 equals 1. 18 divided by 6 equals 3. The answer is 1 and 1 third. Now, it's your time to solve. Change 15 sixths in a mixed number and write eight and one third in improper fraction.